Hey everybody, it's Michelle with Comfy Cozy Living, and I am still wearing the same clothes because I'm taping another haul for you. This is going to be a St. Vinny's haul, and I was with um, Danny, so uh, yeah, we were, when was this? Saturday. This is Saturday, because then we went to Goodwill the next day. Oh, I... Uh, I love this so much. I might have this already. I might have had this. This You're going to see this. Hmm, I don't know. I might be posting this for s Friday. And you will have seen it in a sale already. Because I am... I'm putting this in tonight's sale on Tuesday. This is... Ah! Uh, it's so beautiful. I don't know. I fell in love with this set. Skyline Tudor Plate. Um, Oneida Community Made. I feel like this is just super gorgeous. It's this set is just look at the look at the engraving and everything on that and the the patina. I feel like this is Like, I hit it out of the park. <laughs> this is just another... I have one of these already. And I feel like when I have a mid-century sale, then I'm going to have this for it. Um, I have... I forget if the other one I have is round or if it's square. It actually might be a round one also. For some reason, that's what I'm thinking. But... It's, they're just cool. These are cool. They add your atomicness to your, um, to your, your, oh, gosh, somebody left a candle in here or a stir, stir now thing, but that's not, that's not a big deal right now. Anyway, it's just, I, I, I think it's a neat piece. I, I love the, love those. Okay. Then I've got this. And the funny thing is that it doesn't have, like, uh, it has, it's just, you know, the three things, right? And it's, you know, you take the lids off. Well, guess what? I just bought three little Tupperware spoons today at Goodwill. Might be a different set, slightly different color. But they'll be able to be used with this easily. So, super cool. I, and this is, this, I, this is going to be in tonight's sale too. I love this so much. I just, I just think it's stunning. I fell in love with this and that, that sugar and creamer. And I just feel like you're going to be able to make the most beautiful, like, vignettes and everything with these very pretty I um I was kind of in a groove of this oh it's been probably 10 years ago anyway because I gotta think about you know I did live at my house for a good five years and then another year since then and more years before that and so it's been 10 or 15 years but I was in this silver phase with, you know, like the silver, um, pictures and, and like the, you know, not necessarily any of the trophy things. I wish I ever had that, but, um, I just, am, I think that I'm, it's coming around for me again because I am in love with this. So, um, sorry. Got some sour uh, green apple, and I also got cinnamon because I have been very dry. My new meds are making me very dry. Very, very dry. All right. Let's see what I got wrapped up. Oh, this is going to be for Easter. Oh, this is so darling. I saw this, and now, I mean... 
I don't always like to save things, but this reminded me of when Jack was a baby. I can't help myself. <laughs> Although his outfit had a little tail sticking out. He was sleeping on his belly and he had a tail sticking out. But look at this. Isn't that cute? And then the little outfit has a little butt crack showing. <laughs> but yeah, I thought, oh, it's so precious. So, so precious. Look at the little baby. Little kissy lips. Yeah, so that that will be put away for, for Easter. And hopefully not get ruined. This one I also really loved. And I don't know, maybe I'll have this in t tonight's too. I'm just not really sure because I got to look at things. But um, I am like, I don't know why I'm vibing with some of this really pretty feminine stuff. Um, and it wouldn't necessarily be stuff that I would be um, decorating with. Well, obviously I'm not decorating with anything right now, really. But, um, but like for other people, I like to go with, you know, what, what their vibe is. And I love the way this looks. And it, honestly, I guess it is probably that, uh, probably fits in with that cottage core, right? And, um, because it's got a bit of the shabby chicness to it. And it's just this little, like, trinket plate. Um, honestly, you could use this for, um, butter, you could just use it for um, like a candle or a couple candles. Um, uh, just like set your rings down on it, things like that. I, I just, I'm, I don't know what it is, but I like, I've been getting pulled to certain things, and I don't always have an explanation for them. <laughs> Sometimes it's just that, you know, they're cool, period. All right, this is made in the USA. And we have all seen this before, something made by Helen. I know that fat birds have had something made by Helen. I know I have had things made by Helen. Um, I'm not sure who Helen is. I don't know if I remember or not. Well, I mean, I know I don't remember, but anyhow... There's, there's this sweet, sweet owl. So, she might be on night set. Here's an Easter thing I'll be putting away um, for a while. And it is a Lefton. 1984 GOZ Lefton. Wait, is it? Yeah. And it's just a cute little egg cart. <laughs> He's so sweet looking. <sighs> Here is one of these. They're these things where it's like on one side, it's, it like, it's the same on both sides, you know? Let's see. And it's just, that's all it is. It's just that. So maybe I'll make a little set with that other owl. This is just an Avon, nothing on it, um, but I liked it because of the um, milk glass of it, and also um, I, I just like the pink, um, the pink cap. So, got it. There it is, Avon. So. I think I found several Avons at that 
today at that day yesterday. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I found a piece of Italian pottery. <laughs> very nice, very, very nice. I've been getting pretty lucky about finding some Italian pottery lately. I'll tell you that much. And I will take it. So. Yeah, it says, well, I think that's what it is. Heck, maybe I'm wrong. E -I -T -A. Oh my gosh. Maybe I'm wrong. Pretty sure it's Italy. Yeah. There's I-T-A-L on the top of the Y. I, and I thought I looked it up too, to be honest. I'm pretty sure I looked it up. It was valued in the 20s, so. Um, got... This, this is really pretty. I love the Opal House letters. And um, I'm not really buying too many of these anymore. Like, I feel like I kind of have run out of people getting the ones that were by, um, they were Opal House, but a different kind of one. This one is different. It's got the really cool handle. And it's pink on the inside. I love this. This is a great mug for an E. So it has to be for an E person. I mean, it doesn't have to be. If you like the mug, just get the mug. But it says E on there. so And it's on both sides, so I like that too. But I'm very excited because... Um, spoiler alert. I found myself on a... a um, anthropology initial mug today at Goodwill. Not one of the original ones, but an even better one. I love it so much. All right. So what else did I get at the, um, St. Vinny's? I'll show you. I got this little jar. It's all, oh, no, I'm like, here, smell it. It's a little strong, but there's nothing in it. But it's really nice. It's got the old paper on there. And then that on the lid. And then... Oh, does this one have? Yes, I thought so. And then... This one... Is... This one is to a Wild Rose Powder Sachet. I don't know what the other one was. But let's see how this one. Now, this one doesn't really have any smell. They just cleaned it out better. And then, see, they both have something on the top. One of them has the bottom thing. That's no biggie. And then they're both, they both have the um, paper wrap. So, I mean, just like, look, how pretty is that? And that's just, you know. Just kind of happened. So, there you go. And, all right, one more bag. I got this for Jill because it says beach towel, but we use these pretty big towels here. And um, she was getting rid of a bunch of her towels because she wanted them all to be like red and white. Um, polka dots. Now, the other ones have red with white polka dots. This is white with red polka dots. But I'm pretty sure she's going to like it. So, I'll be um, giving this to her when she gets home today. And that. Oh, I thought this was cute. So, I got to try to figure something out to make this. It says it's three-fourths of a yard by 17 inches. 
I don't know. But anyhow, so this is this. It, it's got Richard, Lisa, David, Maria, Brian, Jeremy, Elena, Rachel, <laughs> Joe, who's my ex, Lily, and then I think it says Mary. I don't know. And that's down here, right? And then up top of that, um, it's got... Um, Cheryl, Tony, Emily, Scott, and Yolanda. And I think those are the only, like, you know, variations of names. But it's just an odd amount of this vintage um fabric. So maybe I'd be able to work something up. I don't know. We'll see. We'll, we'll, we'll just, we'll just wait and see. <laughs> Um, I got this. I love this because it's just, it's, um, oh, it's vintage Christmas perfection. It's just, I just love it. It's like nothing. It, I just love it because you have to like look at it, you know, and you could tell this is an old worn vintage towel. It's got Santa just sitting there by the clock. Waiting for the right time to go. Look at the little thingy that jumped out. A little birdie. And it says Noel. And um, I just like it a lot. And then there's this one too. That. Um, ah. Um, well, I hope that piece came out. Anyhow. Oh, no. There it is. It's a different color. And then there's this one. I am pretty sure I'm going to sell this one. Um... Not sure about this one yet. I I just don't know. I'll probably sell it. <laughs> I'll probably sell it. We'll see. All right, this is like a vintage. I think I think this is vintage. Um, it's from Goody, which is like you know the hair. You know, like hair bands and stuff. And so, um, my guess, for some reason, I feel like this one is, let me look at it though. I just feel like this is a vintage little hair thing, but I don't know. It says goodie. And I just thought I could use something like that. So I got that. Um, I got these because the other day I sold a um, some cereal bowls with a uh, toucan Sam and um, what's his name, corny cornflake or something like that, and. Um, and the Snap Crackle Pop guys, okay? So the those I that I had sold, um, I saw those same ones, okay? Well, no, I shouldn't say that. I saw um, they had um, Toucan Sam and they had um, Corny Corn Flake. But um, they were in bad condition, really, really bad condition. And so... I did not get them, but then I was like looking at other, um, the stuff in the same area and I found these and these are, oh, I'll say, um, I'll say they're newer. Okay. But I don't know what year. I mean, they're not like new, they're just newer, 
they're still, um, I think they're still vintage, but yeah, I don't know for sure because I don't remember. I don't remember these. So this is, um, This is, I'm going to see if it has a year. Okay, yeah, this is way newer. 2014. I knew, it, I guess it is new, new. 2014, and I'm imagining this is the same. 2014. So, they're still really cool. Because I would say they're still uh, regarded as collectors. So, um... This is Sunny, and this is Toucan Sam, and I think they're really cool. They're bigger, a little bigger of a bowl, so even better for the uh, cereal or ice cream. Yes, so yeah, I thought these were still, I mean, super cute, um, you know, like colorful and cute and durable. Um, oh, this is fantastic. Now, of course, the Avon lover in me, like, flipped over this. Um, and sadly, <laughs> my um, my children, <laughs> my son, uh, is a little old for this, considering that he will be... Um, He will be, uh, oh my gosh, it's already November. Oh, wait, what's today? Is today the 8th? So, in 20 days, my son is going to be 22. Oof. So, he's too old for this. <laughs> but this is so good. Oh, it's so, so good. So, here's the box. So you can kind of see what's coming, right? A truck. It's a, it's a According to an Alexa Answers contributor, a bacon factory. Thanks. Um, it is from 1981. And it's an Avon Clean em Up Pump liquid, liquid clean cleanser with pump dispenser. So, here is, and there's still stuff in there. So, you would put that on there, right? See, and then that's how it would be. So, this you, I mean, it's got a little stuff clogged in there. That's easy enough to clean. So, you clean that up. You can empty this and put your own soap in there if you feel like you don't want to use what's in there. Just empty it out. Put some of that soft soap or whatever in there. And you'll be fine. It is... Um, oh, it already, I already said it was 1981. And also, it has... Oh, this is so good! It has stickers! It has the stickers... That go on this. Ah, oh, this is like if your kid, if you had a boy and you sold Avon back in the day or something, and he's gonna be like, Oh my god, I had that! Like, like I could just see you buy it for your kid, and all of a sudden your husband's gonna be like, I had that! I want to put the stickers on. <laughs> So that's pretty, pretty good. I, you know, being the Avon lover that I am, I said, like I said, I, I, I freaked when I was like, oh my God, it's in the, you know, I wish it was a girl's old like thing like that. That would be so great. Um, this is, um, yeah, it's got some salt in there or pepper. I think it's pepper. Nope. It's salt. Anyway, I love this. I wish that it was a pear. But it is not. So I did just buy one because you never know when the other one might turn up. Um, I do have to empty it out because it is um, 
it does have stuff in it, but I'm keeping that. Um, this is just um, a cool pack of note cards that I'll be using in my my stuff. And it's got stickers too, so that's that. So anyhow, that is what I've got from that haul. And this is going to be at 25 minutes, so I think that's going to be it. So this was a great um, St. Vinny's haul. Let me know what you think is your favorite item. I have too many to choose from here, I know. So just know that if you missed the Tuesday night sale, you might have missed out, period. That's all I know for sure. All right. I hope you enjoyed this haul, you guys. Please leave a uh, or hit that thumbs up for me. Leave a comment down below. Tell me what your favorite items were. I, uh, am I on the mark with some things? Am I feeling the right vibes when I say this is what I think is so pretty? And I think, you know, am I, am I going to be able to, um, spread the joy of certain products just because I think it's super cool? Let me know. And, um, yeah, how much Avon can you handle? Just let me know because it's not going to stop anyway. <laughs> All right, you guys. Thanks so much. Bye.